When you call your vet, you want to give them all of the horse's vital signs, including their pulse. But how do we prepare our horse for a stethoscope? Of course, we place the stethoscope piece right behind their left elbow on their side, but you may not get to start there. Here, Aya is really comfortable with having her tushy touched, or sometimes her face. So we got behind a rope and we slowly work where she is comfortable. Then we progressed to being out in the open paddock. We got super lucky because it was spring, so she was super itchy, but you'll notice I still don't start right behind her elbow. I start all over her back and get her comfortable first. Next, we introduce a stethoscope. We would like to engender as much curiosity as possible. So first we'll let her give a good sniff. And then later I will touch her with my own hand, but have it in the other hand. So I'm still not touching with a stethoscope. I'm just holding it with me. Finally, we touch her with the actual stethoscope. Notice at first I do it for just short bursts so she can get used to the sensation. Do this. Yep. Very good, honey. Very good. You want to try to lick it? I'd love to hear your heart. That'd be cool. I'd love to hear your heart. Could I hear it? Oh, I heard it. That's so cool. I heard your heart. Eventually, you'll just build up until you can get the full 15 seconds to get their heart rate. You'll take the number of beats you hear in 15 seconds and you'll multiply that by four and that gives you the number of heartbeats per minute. Remember that each lub dub equals one heartbeat and a normal heartbeat for a horse would be 28 to 44 beats per minute. Thanks for dropping by. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and drop by bridlesandbreath.com to sign up for our monthly newsletter and learn about our online courses.